Hi, I'm Jenny Del Pozo, and today we're working out with your resista bar. So I want you to take your resista bar and put on the green band, because this is an upper body workout for you. Of course, if you want to go heavier, grab your red. <laughs> and let's go ahead, you're going to put your bar down first, and let's uh, warm up this body a little bit first before we get into this, okay? So you can bring that down for just a second. Take a nice wide stance right here, and then start to just circle the shoulders up and around. And just move through that body, see what it feels like today. Move through those little nuggets of tension, whatever you need there. Make them as big as you want. And then reverse your circles the opposite direction. Just flowing through these. Two more. Last one. Now you're going to reach the arms out to the sides. I want you to flex through the hands and we start to circle these arms around. So we're just warming up these, this body, warm up these shoulders a ton right here. Flexing through those hands, you're going to feel the underside of the arm have to open up as well. The more you can flex those hands back, the better off we are here today. We go for four, three, two, one. Reverse your circles the opposite direction, moving through it up. Uh, uh, now there's always that soft little bend in your knees, especially when we grab your resista bar today. I want you to always have that soft bend behind the knees. So that way you're never locking into the legs, into your joints, and then dumping into the low back. I want that body nice and strong and supporting our upper body work today. We go for four, three, two, one. Hold it here. Flip the palms up. Wrap it under and up. Under, up. Keep that up right there. Under, up. Go for four, three, two, and one. And bring it down. Shake it out. Let's do one more big movement right here. So we're going to pitch your weight a little bit over to the diagonal and just circle that arm around. Circle, circle. So you can make these smaller at first and then feel free to give me that big arm right here. Circle. Go four. Three, two, one, other side. Just circle it and circle. Then maybe start to make them a little bigger. Big old circles here. Go for four, three, two, one, and rest from there. Shake this all out. Now we're going to grab your resistor bar. Okay, so from here, I want you to step into the band. Make sure that footing feels nice and good there and make sure you're nice and even on the sides of the band here. You're gonna grab onto your resistor bar. Draw the shoulders down and back. Give me that soft bend in your knees again. We go for big bicep curls right here. So we go all the way up and down. All the way up and down. You wanna feel those glutes reaching towards each other. Strong legs here. Abs are pulling in and up. Shoulders are down, collarbones are wide. Now just know, even this green band can get a little heavy when we're working the upper body. So maybe you have to squat a little lower into this. That'll always take up a little of that tension if you need it today. Listen to that body. Go for four, three, go two, last one. I want you to come all the way down, roll the shoulders back, then from here we come halfway, then all the way down. Halfway, all the way down. <sighs> Nice and strong right here. I know you're feeling this work. <sighs> halfway. <sighs> Just two more. Two. Last one, you hold it halfway. You come all the way up, then halfway down. All the way up, halfway down. Whoo! <sighs> Elbows are just hugging in by the ribs. You're not squeezing into the ribs. I want a little bit of movement in those elbows still too. <sighs> oh, you're feeling it. Give me three. You go two. Last one, guess what? We go all the way down, all the way back up again. <sighs> Inhale as you lower, exhale as you come up. <sighs> and then take this at your pace today. Feel free to go slower than I am. Feel free to go faster. All I care about is that you are working, you are not giving up, and that form is correct here. Two more, two of them. Last one. You come halfway, all the way down. Halfway, all the way down. Keep that bend in those knees. Here we go. Four of them. Three of them. 
Go two. Last one. Hold it right there. All the way up. Halfway. <sighs> Strong arms. You're almost there. Keep it up for four. Three. Two. Last one. Just hold it right here. Hold for four. Three. Two. One. Bring it down. Bring it all the way down. And just shake it out. <sighs> Walk it off. Let it all go. We're going to go right back into that resist bar. So I want you to just let it go. Take a little breather. Maybe even just reach those arms up overhead. Nice and slow here. Ah. And around. Two more like that. Reach. And around. One more. And around. All right. We pick up that bar again. Make sure when you're picking this bar up too, let's think about that form, right? I'm going to stand onto the green band already since it's down here. I'm hinging back from the hips, abs are on, and then I pick up, okay? So that way you're nice and strong and always safe and protective on the back. Then you can always adjust the feet as needed. All right, now from here, I'm going to bring the feet a little closer together so it's less resistance. So make that connection, right? The wider the stance, the more resistance you're going to have in that band. Okay, so I'm going to take my stance closer, bend those knees, we serve the platter. So you're going to hug the elbows back, you reach these arms forward, then pull back. Reach it forward and back. This is not easy to do. So guess what? It might be a little lower to start out. Start low, find that form, then pick it up when you're ready. Reach it. We're not here for long in this one because it's a lot. Maybe get a little lower if you need to. Go for four, three, two. I want you to try to hold those arms out there. Keep a soft little bend. Hold for four, Woo. three, two, and one. Bring it down. Roll it out again. Woo. Okay. Now this next one. You're going to reverse your grip and we're going to go into an upright row. So draw the shoulders down and back, abs are in, up and down. All that muscle movement feels so good doing this bigger movement after the one we just did. Now we're working not just those biceps, not just those shoulders, into the back a little bit more. Feel those lats having to try to connect your wings here. Collarbones are wide. Abs are in and up, soft bend in those knees still. For me, my feet are just a little wider than the hips, just a hair here, that's totally great. Go for four, three, two, hold it at the top, just hold. Hold for four, nice and strong right here. Three, two, and one. Bring it down, roll those shoulders back. Now from here, you're going to hinge the hips back. We're going to go into a row. So I'm just going to show you from the side a little here. You want to pull those elbows back to the back diagonals as you're hinging forward, and then you lower. So you reach it back and down. Now again, if you want a little bit more resistance, walk the feet a little wider. I don't want this crazy resistance on this one. I want you to feel your muscles on your back working. So when it's not too heavy, it lets you turn off, say, your biceps and work into your shoulder blades a little bit more, your scapulas, your rhomboids. <sighs> Neck is nice and long. Make sure that spine is nice and long as well. Eight more. Pull it back. Go six. <sighs> Go four. Three. Two. Hold it back there, little pulses, pulse it up and back. Reach, reach, find those shoulder blades hugging. Abs are still in and up. Here we go for eight of them. You go six, go four, three, two, one. Rest from there. Whew. Now, this next one's a little different. 
Try it out. If it doesn't work today, that's totally fine. We'll work up to it, okay? So now you're gonna step. I want you to reverse into your strap here. And now the hands are behind the head, uh, behind the back with the resistor band. Now you're gonna hinge slightly forward. Now I'm gonna walk my feet a lot closer because this one is a tough one. Now again, if the shoulders are a little tight and you're rolling it forward, take a wider grip here. Okay, I want you to keep those shoulders back as much as you can. You hinge slightly forward, abs are in and up. Then from here, we lift this bar up, up. It's small, you're not gonna be able to go too far because I want you to keep the shoulders on your back. Neck is nice and long. Woo, ah, so strong. We finished strong right here together. I'm right there with you. Reach, up, reach. Here we go, eight more, eight. Go six, go four, three, two, one, and done. Woo! Let's go ahead and take your bar down. Take a nice wide stance. Circle those arms out and around and up. Inhale and exhale. Again. Last one. Hold it at the top, thread the hands together, reach up and over to one side, getting that nice body length out of that left side or right side, listen to that body. Come back up, up and over to the other side, side body stretch. And back up, go ahead and circle those arms out and around, roll those shoulders back, and you, my friend, are all done with that resistor bar workout. I'm Janet Del Pozo. Nice work. I'll see you again soon.